get out there and just experience uh, the tranquility and you know, the silence of the, the Royal Canal on a bike, it is definitely great for our mental health. It's something I would encourage anyone to do. It is Ireland's longest greenway, so this is the big attraction, traffic-free cycling in the Royal Canal. For me, the Royal Canal Greenway has opened up many avenues for not just the people of the locality, but for tourism all over Ireland and even further afield. We're fourth generation farmers here and uh, we started the cookery school in 2012. This is what we love to expose the student to be creative in the kitchen, creative with food, strip it all back and let the students put their hands into the earth and experience the feeling and then the taste and the enjoyment. the chairperson of the Baltras and Aboreen Biodiversity Group, a group of local people who live near the canal, who walk on the canal, and decided some years ago that we were going to do what we could, not only to maintain biodiversity, but to improve it. We have a special area. It is a reduced mowing regime, which means that the wildflowers flourish every month of the year or even every day. I walk it every day and people say, oh, don't you get bored? But no, I don't get bored because there is so much life.